Hello everyone and welcome if you're new here, a very big welcome to you if you've been here before, a very big welcome back. Today we are playing the Moons of Arden. Well, the demo of it anyway. This is a colony builder, space colony builder. So it's a city builder management game where you rebuild and expand your civilization across moons in a planetary system. You follow the Oxenauts, the survivors of a generational ship that crashed on a lonely moon, isolated, cut off from people. They need your help to restore their culture and reconnect with their homeworld. So, this is our moon. There are many moons like it, but this is ours. So we start by placing a city center. You can rotate with uh, Q and E. We shall place it there. So we're gonna build a city center and then we're gonna build some shelters and a woodcutter's hut. You can hold shift to drop multiples. And a woodcutter's heart. One more a day. We'll drop it there. Speed things up a bit. As they walk, they will make little paths. I do enjoy that. So next we need a hydroponic farm in which we need a two woods. show you the employment you can change the uh, employment for it it's a nice little like casual builder <coughs> so the hydroponic farm we'll use the hydroponic farm to make a nutrient paste as soon as we get wood We have one wood, we have a two wood, this one you don't need to, um, you don't need to like place farms in that, or the plots I should say, or a lot of them you have to like place plots in that. Let's build another shelter. So that we have everything. So we're making three a day. So now we need water and a water purifier. Biofilament. How do we get biofilament? Okay. 
Okay, so water collector. And a water purifier. Spin that round. You spin me right round, baby, right round. Reach 15 to make new material, biofilament. So I need 15 people, so I need one more peoples. Okay, so now I can have up to 21, because each one can have a 3. So we have a Bio Crusher, which crushes 6 wood into a 3 of Biofilament, which means we probably need another... One of those. So we can get some more woody in. So we got the bio crusher, wood in a biofilament. And then we'll use that to uh, build stuff. Once we get the wood for it, we can place that down. Place that down there. take wood there oh, apparently I need more uh, more peoples need another uh, I need more wood for that uh. wood can I has wood? So that makes two a day. That makes two a day. <coughs> that makes four a day. to the dirty water plant. I do like the fact that the tutorial actually says, hey, X needs to be done. So now I need to hit 30. satisfied everyone's satisfied another house there
So then we have a warehouse. We should be able to drop a warehouse there, which will basically pop all them. Is there a front? There's a front. You can see the radiuses of everything, which I like. Okay, so now they will go out and collect. We need 42. Now we got one. Water is above. Oh, we need more nutrient paste. We need some more houses. So, wood is good, biofilament's good, water's good, nutrient paste is good, grey water is good. We should probably drop another grey water. Two grey waters and a... another water. Purifier. I do like the fact that you can just hover over things here and it will show you basically everything. And give you a nice little graph. I do like nice little graphs. Okay. Drop another house or two. That should get us to the next level. This is our solar system. It's not us. That's not us. There we are. So now we got the community center. Uh... That house wasn't very smart building that there. We'll give everyone their community center. I should make all these another plus one. Apparently that one's just... Uh... Oh, well that one doesn't... I right, got fluffy old, it's good. Another community center there. Go to a couple of houses over here. Oh, I need an eight eighty two. Going for water. Water's good. Shrimp paste is good. I 
should get us to 82 so we can get settlers. New population, settlers. So, just building uh, three store slots. Can I upgrade that? How do you upgrade? Ah. Fancy. <laughs> well, now they won't close. New production chain, making clothes. So I need a textile farm, into a weaver, into a clothes factory. Need 125 for that. Oh, no, I don't. Oh, oh, I see. So you got different thingies based on their jobbies. So let's place that there. Oh, and a stone quarry. Oh, Daddy should have done a stone quarry. I need what? Are they, seven of them. Oh, and we have to deal with pollution too. So do I need to place this special or? No, I just place it anywhere. Oh, this community center, that's water purifier. Where's the warehouse? There's the warehouse. I have to put down another warehouse. Definitely gonna have to put down another warehouse. Watch all that cover. Fabric Weaver. And we need a clothes factory. So yes, this game is all about production chains. And logistics. We're gonna need three of those. Oh, 
Okay, so we need some more houses. Because I now have 109 jobs. But only 96 peoples. I suppose once we get that sorted up, maybe we'll get another person. <gasps> Yay! We get more people. So each time you fulfill, the houses allow you to take more peoples. Twenty-five. So one hundred and twenty-five to hit tools. I mean, it's a cute little game. I mean, <coughs> as colony builders go, it's nice and relaxed. Yeah, this is been nice of a game. I mean, if you like what you see, make sure you hit the like button, hit that subscribe button, ladies and gentlemen. And um, I'm going to be leaving the link in the description. So that if you feel like you might like this game, you can grab it. You can, it's out for sale right now. And uh, I hope you have a great day.